I'm the best battle in the world! No one can beat me! <laughs> I'm just kidding, I suck. I sounded like Markiplier. Hello everybody, it's Markiplier and welcome back to it. <laughs> hey guys, what's going on? It's Russo Plays and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Brick Bronze PvP Battles. Today, we're actually battling one of my highest donators, Frozen Army TV. If you guys have watched the streams, you know that Frozen... Uh, I'm Just Frozen has been donating like crazy, been awesome part of the Cringe Dab Nation, so I said, yo, we gotta battle now. <laughs> I don't know why, <laughs> like, oh, you donated? I'm gonna battle you. But no, he really wanted to battle, so we're gonna take him on, and I think he's gonna beat me. <laughs> I think Frozen's gonna beat me. Uh, I can never beat, oh my god, I do not have my team. Wait. Oh god. When you have to forfeit, guys, I didn't have my right team. I gotta forfeit. Oops, losing them battle points. Okay, that's better. <laughs> I'm so stupid, I picked the wrong team, but now I got my team all lined up, and um, <laughs> I'm ready to battle Frozen. So, the Jolteon is gonna be kinda tough. Oh my gosh, a Zorark. I've actually never faced a Zorark, so we'll see how that goes. If you guys are hyped for this episode of Pokemon Break Rock PvP, make sure to hit that like button. Let's see if we get to a thousand likes. We've been getting a thousand likes every single video and that's crazy. So smash that little like button if you want to, because it'll make him feel good. Oh, he's winking at me. He's winking. Okay, so he starts off with Shaman. I'm gonna start off with a Stealth Rock and probably a little Rock Slide action. So we'll go Stealth Rock first. I don't think, yeah. I don't think he has a move to KO me in one hit, so. Oh, he's got the flinch. No. Oh no! And now he's setting up! Yo, that's sick! That was sick. Alright, now let's see if I can get a rock slide. Come on, rock slide. Just a rock slide. One rock slide. Oh. He's gonna KO me right here. What a good... That was a good tactic. That was a good tactic. Okay. So he's got Shaman. I'm probably gonna go with my red dragon. Just because I can use flamethrower and it'll do a bit... It'll do a little dab of damage. He's gonna withdraw and send out his water type. Oh, Jolteon, okay. I actually, there's potential that I can kill this with, with flamethrower. I probably won't, but if I can kill this with flamethrower, that would be good. That would be very, very good. Okay. So let's use a little flamethrower action. Come on, Red Dragon. Come on, Red Dragon, get a little KO. If I kill, if I kill this Jolteon, that would be huge. Thank you! The critical hit! Oh my god. Oh my god. He's probably upset. I think I would have killed it anyway, to be honest. Maybe not. Okay, so he's got Gengar. Gengar's probably gonna have Thunderbolt, so that's... I probably should switch. But I'm just gonna go for Flamethrower. <laughs> yeah, bad move. Honestly, bad decision. Probably should have switched. <laughs> Oh man, I should have switched. Well, I'm gonna send out my Gengar. Hopefully, I can outspeed. If I switched out to Gengar and then he just attacked me, actually, I probably could have got away with that. Or for these meddling kids. But this way, yeah, oh my gosh, he outspeeds me. I don't know why, but I'll kill him because I have a Focus Sash. So, the Focus Sash always helps, kids. <laughs> if you don't know what items to put on your Pokemon, do a Focus Sash. You can get it, it with battle points in the Coliseum shop. Okay, so I have two down, I believe, and then one almost down, and he has two down. So, I'm not sure who he's gonna bring out next. Maybe Shaman again? I'm not sure. Oh, boy. He's got the Salamence. This is quite scary. Oh, gosh. Salamence is always such a tough Pokemon to, to face for me, because I don't have much to go against it. All I really have is... Um, all I really have is my Dragonite. My Dragonite is so slow and misses all the time. I'm just gonna go for a Shadow Ball. It won't... Okay. It probably won't kill it. I might go first, though. i probably go first. I don't think it'll kill it, but we'll see. It's our only hope, because if I switched out, I probably would've died. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow, he goes first. How? My Gengar's got so much speed. I always get outsped. Like, I EV train all my Pokemon in speed, and I just always get outsped. I just don't get this game. <laughs> Alright, so I'll use Ice Beam. If I don't go first, then this makes no sense. Greninja is like, so fast. Oh, who's he gonna switch to? 
Oh! Didn't see that coming. Alright, so if I can go for if he goes first, I don't get it because this is fully EV trained Greninja. Thank gosh. Oh my god, I still didn't kill it? What? Why'd he do so much and I only did? <laughs> that makes no sense. Why'd he do so much and I did like nothing? Oh man. It's probably because his EVs are more in attack. But still, it just doesn't make any sense. And Shaman's probably going to outspeed me, which really, uh, Blue Girl is like so fast. I don't get why. How? How does it outspeed me? I really need to get a better team, guys, because it seems like Shaman is OP. It seems like all these Pokemon are so overpowered, and I'm just, I'm just a noob using the wrong Pokemon, it seems like. Because Dragonite, oh, does nothing for me. <laughs> like, honestly, Dragonite does absolutely nothing. Dragonite's my favorite Pokemon, but I don't think I can use it in battles anymore because it just keeps, it just loses battles. It's just so slow and it's, it has horrible special attack and it's just, it's just not good. But, um, oh, he's got the Salamence. See, Salamence is going to outspeed me for sure. Dra one Dragon Claw, it's going to kill me. Easy. Easy bangers. See, look at that. And then I'll have my Sceptile out, and I'll have nothing to do. So, this is game. That's pretty much game. He's got two Pokemon left. Um, I can't remember what his other one is. I don't know what else he has, but I'm just going to go for a dual chop, and he's going to get a double edge on me, and he's going to kill me. So, oh, the Focus Ash. I might kill this. Nice! And then you got an animation for Dual Chop. So I won't win this battle, but at least it's one against one. If I somehow win this, that would be amazing, but no, it's gotta be game. That's gotta be game. Zorark is gonna... Oh, man, this is tough. He didn't even use his Illusion ability, which is kind of funny. But um, if I can go first and use Next Scissor and kill it, that would be... Oh, no, it's game. Outspeeds me. Got me. That was pretty close, though. It did come down to one Pokemon. GG. So good game, Frozen. Frozen beat me, guys. Like I always say, I am I'm clearly not the best battler. I still have tons of work. I do not at all claim to be good or amazing or anything at battling. So just keep that in mind. But I love it and I try I'm trying to get better, so just bear with me. You know, someday I will be good enough to beat anybody. I'm just kidding, I probably won't. <laughs> but as you can see, our rank is 2131. And we're trying to get up onto the top 20. So we, we have a lot of work to do. I'm still working on my team. I still got to EV train some Pokemon. Maybe I'll be up there one day. But if you guys are enjoying this episode or this series of Pokemon Brick Bronze PvP, be sure to smash that like button. Comment down below your username if you want to battle me. And if you want to play some games with me, make sure you follow me on Roblox and on Twitter at Russo Talks. And subscribe if you're new. Turn on notifications as well. Did my character just move? I'm not even touching the control. That guy's naked. That guy's naked. My character just moved. I don't know what's happening. But um, thanks for all the support in the chat, guys. And thanks for supporting the channel. We're almost to 100,000, which is not so McGee. Extravagant craziness. So that's going to be dope. But again, thanks for the Battle Frozen. Check out Frozen's channel in the description. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good time. And remember to always... Look both ways before crossing the street. Thank you. <laughs>